If you're new here, my name is Travis Ridgen. I'm a 96-born gold player playing here in the Detroit area for the Motor City Rockers in the FPHL, also known as the Fed. And today is Monday. It's the start of the new work week, and we are preparing for a road trip to New York this Thursday night. And it all starts right here. At the end of the day, I'm doing what feels right for me and chasing down my dream. What a, what a, what a rally. And you blew it. What is that, like 5 nothing? Yeah. And 11 all. Oh, no. And it's over, ladies and gentlemen. Do we want a post-game interview from the loser today? <laughs> I'm going to need a couple whiskey glasses after that one. I feel like I wasted that match on you. Definitely not you proof. I'm uh, dodging potholes in my Silverado. Yeah, we'll try again Monday because we can't bring the ping pong table on the bus. No, we so. cannot. I mean, we could probably try. Number practice. <laughs> Starbucks advertising. So I go to Starbucks every single morning because they have the best filtered water on the planet. And it is free and it's like seven bucks for a latte. I just come and exploit the uh, free water. Back to the vlog. No, you can't do that. My cage is all fucked up. No. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you you tried to get me. You are getting max fine for that. <laughs> I no, somebody took the bottle. Someone took it off. Oh, so that. evidence right there on yeah, my yeah, foot. Yeah. Somebody tried Frank to get me back from. Uh, Someone shot Frank in That's yeah. evidence for a max fine. Well, how was it a max fine? I was the because because I would. This guy's claiming to be the victim when he dumps all on my foot. How, how is he the victim? Let us know in the comments section who's at fault here. <laughs> kind of walking through a line of fires. <laughs> Now in the Fed, we are a warrior league, which means we're supposed to only use warrior sticks. Now this right here is Kirk Allen, and he's the head brand manager for Warrior Goalie. And he drove all the way down to come show me the brand new Warrior Ritual M2I Goal Stick, new for 2022. And it wasn't too long after that where a bunch of the guys started to come over and check out the new stick. This here is Mr. Kirk Allen, head warrior rep. Man, haven't seen him in four years. Good to see him today. And he's got some goodies. New shaft shape, more durable, lighter, faster poke check, faster blocker transition, and ultimately, more control, more leverage, better accuracy, because this shape is actually designed to fit into the heel of the trapper. Transitions at the top and at the shoulder, so where your blocker is in your stance, and when you're holding it with your blocker too, it feels normal. People got questions, where can they find you? We're going Instagram. Now. So today goalie coach Bill is not here, but even when he's not, I'm still trying to get better. And today I'm working with Tim Perks, I'll call him Perksy, and we're trying to work on staying tight in tight. Now this is more opinion based, but at my size, most of the goals that I give up and that are beating me are because I got out of the way. I know that may be hard to believe, but when you break it down, most goals truly are because I either moved too much, I got too horny for the puck, and I just wasn't able to stay tight and plug holes in the right spot. And right here, that's exactly what we are working on, allowing pucks to hit me and plug the hole. We followed that up with a little bit of shootout to end practice, and of course, SPHL legend Scotty Coach reminded me exactly why he's the Zach Bell stunt double. Oh, 
All right, so this is Big Sexy's Sugar Cookie Oat Latte Review. Everyone's like, oh, I can't drink black coffee. You can't drink black coffee. There's something wrong with you. I drink coffee because what it does, it wires me. It gets me going, gives me energy, sexiness. Let's go. Uh, Starbucks is over there. All right. <laughs> your brain, too. <laughs> Pump, pumpkin cream something? Pumpkin cream cold brew. All right, we'll see what this fancy sh** is like. Unreal. It's actually pretty good, but best place to take a check out a day that you never met. Coffee. It's cheap. <laughs> Any good dates recently? I'll go on dates. <laughs> you know, for the most part, I'll be okay. honest with you. I come to the Coyote Joe's. Lats spread like a peacock. I thought it was sugar cookie latte season when we walked in. It's mating season in the Fed Zeno. That's what it is. It's always mating season in the Fed Zeno. Cheers, boys. So over the last few videos, I've been talking about how on the backup here in Motor City, how Babs is like the best goaltender in the league, and then there's the rest of the goalies in the league, and it's not even funny. I wanted to make this like a little bit of a teaching point for you know a lot of the younger goalies and just younger people out there, just maybe even like a borderline life lesson. My job in Motor City is not what can the team do for me, what can I do for the team. As the backup, my job is to be the hype man, to be, you know, Babs needs water bottles, I got it. If the guys need, you know, a smile, that's my job. Now, I'm not like Big Sexy, who will literally spend two and a half hours after practice and ditch me for a lunch date because he wants to shoot pucks. By the way, I haven't forgotten about that. I've only played 44 minutes so far this season is that, you know, goalie coach Bill and I are trying to make a game plan based off 44 minutes of sample size. Yes, it is significantly more difficult to try to do a game plan based on that than if I was playing every night, but that's also part of the job description. Everybody thinks they're the man, right? To say that I want to play games is like stating the sky is blue, right? Everybody playing here wants to play games. There's a patience element to it and working hard to get my game to that level because I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to bullshit that there is things in my game that do need to be fixed. Coach told me I'm going to be getting a start sometime in November. We don't know when, but there will be one game and I will get the next start that is not Baz's. So my job is to prepare for that. I think that if I do the right things, I prepare well and I'm a good teammate. I do think that God is going to not necessarily make the saves for me, but he's going to give me all the tools that are, are going to help me succeed and have a good game and get a win and continue along the path that I want to of helping the team win games because wins are what matters. Winners win. People want winners on their teams, whether it's, you know, a new expansion team in Motor City or one of the teams in the league that have been around forever. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. Check out my podcast on the Biscuit, Spotify, Apple, for your version here on YouTube. There's a link in the description for all that. Thank you for watching. New videos every Sunday and I'll see you soon. Trav is finally figuring out how to play the American style of ping pong. Oh.